am pushing through with using some more of the Trader Joe things that I got this week. So I do have some mashed cauliflower that is frozen. I'm going to make the whole thing because if you guys don't realize that the serving sizes are for me and my boyfriend. My boyfriend eats a lot, so he does eat the keto meals with me, so that's why I end up making a lot, but I'm sharing. Um, so I'm doing the uh, mashed cauliflower, and I did get these Trader Joe fire roasted bell peppers and onions, so I'm gonna do like a little stir fry, I guess, with the heat and serve chicken breast that I showed you guys earlier in the week. And I also got these organic sweet Italian chicken sausage, so I wanted to try this out too. So I'm gonna kinda make this, make like a little gravy or whatever and then just pour it over the mashed potatoes for a meal i also did get trader joe's red pepper that you guys see me using um throughout the video this week and oh, i got the top off this one the onion salt which is works really really good i love this product and i do use the weber's roasted garlic and herb grill thing let me tell you guys something this tastes so freaking good you don't have to grill the food it is so good on just about everything all my proteins i use this it's just it brings the food to life so I'm going to go ahead and make this up. I did go ahead and put the blueberry muffins in the oven. I'm excited to try those. I found it on the recipe online and I just tweaked it a little bit, added a little bit of extra almond milk just to make it fluffier. And yeah, so I'm excited. So we're going to start this. Hopefully you guys enjoy this and my tea is ringing for me in the microwave. So got to go.
it is Thursday, so I did not show my face at all this week until now. So I'm, I hope you guys are happy to see me. So I'm going to do a recipe that I did before, but um, I had a few requests because some people don't like avocados. So I'm going to do deviled eggs. I'm going to do avocado deviled egg. I'm going to do a cheese deviled egg. And I'm just going to do a regular deviled egg. I decided to just revamp it up. Some people say they don't like the taste of avocado or they're allergic to it. So you can also do it with cheese. So I'm going to show you guys how I do it both ways. Uh, for the ones that did not watch my first series, I'll show you guys today how to do that. And also for tonight, I'm going to do seafood. So I'm excited to do that. If you guys didn't know, you can have seafood boil if you're on keto. Just take the potatoes out and you'll be fine. Uh, I just want to mention that the muffins I made last night, the recipe I'll insert down below with the link, the muffins were A1. Everything I used was keto friendly. Uh, the almond flour, everything about it. I'm not sure how to calculate the carbohydrates. It's on the page. I forgot what it was, but I'll probably just insert it in the video. I ended up making 12 muffins, guys, and they were bomb. Not a blueberry fan, but the blueberries in this one, it just gave it so much flavor. So I would definitely go ahead and make those muffins. You could have it in the morning with two slices of turkey bacon and a hard boiled egg if you want. Um, or whatever. I'll probably end up having one anyways with my deviled egg. So yeah. So I just want to put that out there. That recipe is solid. I did tweak mine a little bit, but uh, if you just look at what I did in the video, you'll kind of get a grasp of what I did. And I'll actually tell you guys what extra things I did. So hopefully you guys enjoyed last night's meal. It was delish. Now the cauliflower mashed potatoes from Trader Joe's. Um, I'll probably just take the green giant one over that one just because that one still had like the little clusters It was almost like a grits texture So if I'm gonna do a shrimp and grits I'll use that product to make it because it does have like a little bit of that texture But all in all everything was really really good. So let's just jump right into this I have some water boiling and we're gonna get the deviled egg started
Hi guys, so I am out with Danny. So it is Friday, so I'm having my first meal now and I'm gonna show you guys what I'm gonna eat. It's Greek food and it's keto friendly. <laughs> you wanna say hi, Dan? No. She don't wanna say hi, to just say hi on the distance. Hey. Hey, Dan doesn't wanna show her face, but. Um... Alrighty guys, so this basically wraps up this week's episode of What I Eat in a Week. Hopefully you guys enjoyed this week's series of recipes. Everything was super delicious. So this is the first time I'm trying this product out and overall I can tell you guys I actually really like the quality of these tots. Now my sister did say another brand was gross so I was a little wary with this one but all in all this was good. 12 pieces is equal to 6 snack carbs guys so you can get a nice junk food feel out of this one and still be uh, guilt free free so i really enjoyed this recipe guys hope you guys enjoyed everything in this video leave your comments down below per usual but do not forget guys to thumbs up this video leave your comments down below subscribe and share this video with your friends and your family and i will catch you guys in a later one bye